Vision Cast family. It's Carolyn Litton again, creator of The Vision Project. Thanks for watching and welcome to episode eight, The Outdoor Walk. What I thought would be the most challenging and least favorite part of that original 75 hard challenge ended up being another game changer with the right mindset, of course. Part of the intense 75 hard challenge required two daily 45 minute workouts and one of those was required to be outdoors. Well, I came to discover amazing benefits that re resulted from the outdoor segment. Being outside had such a positive impact on me to the point when I completed 75 hard, I decided to implement an ongoing 30 minute walk into my daily lifestyle. When COVID hit and I found myself working from home a lot, that outdoor walk immensely helped elevate my mood when I was feeling down. Even if it was raining or cold outside, it was so important that I still left the house to go for that 30 minute walk each day. Anyone who knows me well will attest that I absolutely hate the cold, but due to my mindset, I continue walks all year round, including in the winter. I live in the Chicagoland area, so winters are not for the faint of heart. I learned to layer and bundle up so I'm not uncomfortable and can actually enjoy my walk. Hey, first snowfall walk of the season. Whoop, whoop, keep going. On those sub-zero days, I'm still out there and just tell myself to suck it up, buttercup. In the grand scheme of things, it's really not a big deal. Maybe that's the mental toughness and discipline I gained from 75 hard. I must say some of my favorite walks have been on a snowy evening in the winter. I found a massive benefit in connecting with nature. I appreciate nature's true beauty and the vastness of the morning and evening sky. The fresh air in my lungs always feels so refreshing. I embrace solitude and go for a walk early in the morning or late in the evening. It feels fantastic to quiet your mind and embrace the surroundings and just be. The benefits of the outdoor walk are similar to meditation and I feel that they're enhanced when you are outdoors. When my mind is quiet, I've come up with so many good ideas and applications of what I've learned from the books and the podcasts into my business and personal life. Sometimes I'll even go on a walk with my husband or my friend. We've had some great conversations and brainstormed about things that I'm sure we wouldn't have come up with otherwise. I feel like our walks get our creative juices going and it's such a nice time to connect. Angie Wieland Crosby so beautifully expressed, nature is the purest portal to inner peace. I take in all the beauty of nature and notice how the trees look during each change of season. I see how different the sky looks every day and in the evening. I stay present by observing the birds and the animals that cross my path. A sense of gratitude so naturally comes over me as I take everything in. I also feel a deep connection to God when I'm outside. When I look at the sky, I feel such a sense of humility and realize that I'm a tiny speck in his vast creation. It makes me realize also that God called us to do great things and I feel that it's our responsibility to find out what that is and live it out. I learned my calling from the Vision Project and I believe my purpose is to share it with others so they can find their purpose and live out their best lives. Depending on how I feel each day, I either walk in solitude or listen to a podcast or audiobook. Some days I just listen to music that makes me happy, all while taking in the beauty of nature around me. I learned to customize that time for self-care and give myself what I need each day. The other benefit to the outdoor walk is the exercise aspect. Whether you're a fitness novice or an athlete, the daily 30-day walk is key. Daily movement is critical and you can check that off your list by going on a 30-minute walk each day. Depending on how fast you walk, most people will end up walking at least 10 miles a week. So just to recap, every day, deliberately schedule a time for a 30-minute walk. Take in the beauty of nature and just be present on that walk. The mental and physical benefits are quite advantageous and they enhance the other components of the Vision Project. Please join me next week as we discuss the elements of the Vision Project. Feed your body. Please be sure to share this episode with anyone you want to see live their best life. If you have any questions or comments, please reach out. You can do so by going to my website at vpmanifest.com. 
www.thepeopleshow.com. Be sure to follow us on Facebook too. Don't forget to click and subscribe by clicking on the button below, or you can also click here to watch last week's episode. See you next time. And remember, go forth and be awesome.